Hey guys, so I want to do a quick little speed test comparison here of Android O on the Pixel phone, which I'll just show you uh, is on here. Uh, and we do have as well the iOS 10.3.2. Uh, so the latest iOS here, uh, beta software. I'm going to see, you know, how they do compare here. Uh, Cause I like to see, you know, how the software compares on both platforms now and again in terms of the beta software uh, so let's just do the startup and uh, see you know how that compares so apple is quite fast to shut down here and we're going to start them up Or maybe it's uh, not that fast actually. So it did take a while for it to shut down on the iPhone. On the iPhone. So we have a new startup here powered by Android on the Google Pixel, which nobody bought. I bought it. Uh, you can see the iPhone is still much faster here when it comes to the boot up, which is nice. We're still waiting. Do pardon my uh, washing machine. I gotta do washing now and again. It's quite a quiet washing machine. Good old Bosch. Uh, so the Pixel isn't uh, that fast as you can see uh, when it comes to startup, but nevertheless, let's have a look at the you know performance here. Let's see uh, what uh, we've got in terms of the speed. I'm going to be quite brutal today and just open them one at a time. Well, at the same time, but not wait for them, basically. Uh, so let's just quickly go through this. So far, it looks like the iPhone is going ahead here. This hasn't rendered properly. Uh, obviously, Android O is quite a new software so it might have some issues uh, when it comes to the stability here uh, in terms of things much quicker than on the iPhone again here so we did get a pop-up then so I'm not going to count that one that wasn't really fair Facebook Oh, pixel nice and fast that time. Definitely going to count that one. Uh, did we do another one? This Boohoo. Uh, again, pixel just pipped the iPhone. I'm going to do the inbuilt apps. Very similar as you can see. Uh, the weather. Let's just try the main uh, weather. I, I don't know if this is clickable. Yes, it is actually. That's good. Uh, let's just try it again. Quickly here on the right. Uh, camera. Uh, a little bit quicker on the iPhone there again. Uh, get, let's try the App Store. That is a good one to try. Again, iPhone. I think the iPhone is taking it here when it comes to the beta software. Moving on to the games. The games. So you can see Fallout here. Looks like it's in on the iPhone, as you can see. Nice and fast. And we're going to the next one. And this one. So looks like we are in on the iPhone with this one. And we're waiting still on this one. So you can definitely see who is ahead here in terms of the uh, the games here. I think uh, as usual, it is the iPhone 
leading the pack when it comes to the speed. And I think this one is done now in terms of the you know the stuff I wanted to do. Uh, pixel, well, it's tapping out here. It still has another one to do. Uh, so this one. Uh, so, oh, we have the uh, hijack there, trying to install a virus. Uh, we're going to have a look at the speed test of both of them. As you can see, we're on the same thing. Start with the iPhone. So nice and snappy here, starting off. And what can the Pixel do on Android O? I think it's going to be epic. It was epic on uh, Nugget. Oh, come on, Pixel. Don't let us down. Wow, it's taken ages just to start up here. But once you get into it, you can see beast speed. Uh, the ping's not very good, though, for some reason. So a little bit disappointing there. How's the battery holding up? Quite good. Uh, so I think you can see the pixel does win when it comes to your download let's have a look at the multitasking let's go to the back so there shouldn't be any issues here both of them leveraging all oh, reload on uh, pixel pixel boy so you can see, even with the latest Android, we're still having reloads. That uh, is quite disappointing. Especially being in the Android camp. Uh, so let's just try the games here, see if they held them in memory. So we go to Fallout. So that's one. And uh, we do have Sim City. Oh no. Uh, in fact, it could have held it in memory there. It's probably just resuming. But you can see how fast it resumed on the iPhone. I mean, that was quite telling. And the reason why I'm so brutal is because these phones aren't cheap, you know, these Pixel phones. So if they're gonna have, if they're gonna be priced like an iPhone, they're gonna have to perform like one, if you ask me. Uh, so let's just do the last one, which was the uh, flight pilot here. So it kept uh, them all in memory pretty much, but the actual resuming was, I think, a bit faster on the iPhone still. Uh, so, you know, in terms of everything except for the Wi-Fi, the uh, iPhone seemed to be ahead overall in terms of the latest software, which is nice. Uh, but obviously, you know, I think uh, Google has done quite a good job at uh, implementing some nice new features here with the... Uh, you know, new uh, software that we don't get on the iPhone, which is, you know, split screen multitasking, uh, which uh, is very uh, absent, basically, on the iPhone. Uh, the notifications is arguably better handled as well here uh, compared to on the iPhone, where you just have, like, little, like, icons uh, come up with the numbers if you've got a notification definitely prefer that on Android uh, but I think you can see iOS has the better uh, in terms of the information here on the left it looks a bit more well integrated uh, I wish they'd get rid of this kind of white theme on the uh, 
the uh, Google side of things because it kind of takes you away from it. Also, you do get it on the lock screen uh, with the iPhone, which I don't think you do on the uh, the Pixel, unfortunately. So that's something to consider. Uh, but you know, both are very nice phones overall. You know, I think uh, the uh, the camera on the Pixel is still rated higher than the iPhone Seven, which is its trump card at the end of the day. So uh, yeah, just a quick little speed test comparison here between Pixel on uh, Android Zero or Android O or Android Om Omelette. I wonder what it's going to be called. Uh, and uh, yeah, hope you found it helpful and I'll see you in the next one. Cheers.